Okay, I got a little toy for y'all. This is the STB, bro. And I think this gun is the most accurate gun in the game. I'm going to have to test it against the uh, M4. But this motherfucker is beautiful. And I'm going to let y'all know. This build is set up to be a fucking laser beam. It's all built around aim stability and recoil control. Recoil stabilization, all of that shit. Um, and I'm just going to let y'all see it. So this is me aiming at the chest without holding down the analog stick to reduce the recoil. If I can get centered. You see that? Do you see that, bro? That shit is a fucking laser, cuz. But this is me holding down the analog stick a little bit, even though I don't need to. Of course, my aim is off. Forgive me, cuz it's morning time and I'm still sleeping. But look, bro. I can't even <laughs> maintain targets. But y'all get the drift, bro. Y'all get the motherfucking drift, cuz. Like, this gun is very fucking reliable, bro. Now, look, 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 look. Watch this shit. Watch this. I'm gonna aim at they neck. Look at that. Look at that. Of course, at that range, it's a little harder, but, bro. Look at the fucking gun, cuz. Shit is fucking dope. I'm gonna stop yelling in the morning. Stop yelling in y'all ear. I'm sorry. I'm just geeked up, huh? Don't talk about how I talk either. Stupid. But this is the setup I got for it. So I got the FTAC FB20. Boom. Y'all can see the perks right there. Here's the tune. Socking Tread 40. Best fucking muzzle in the game to me for recoil control. The game will stop fucking tweaking on me. I can show y'all the tune. Here's the tune for this. Could y'all take a picture of that? Y'all look at that number. Uh, plus 46 for the recoil stabilization. And plus 18 for the kick control. Attack Ripper. Again, one of the better of the attachments. Here's the tune for that one. Kablau Kablooey. We're using the Bruin TS-30 comb, as y'all can see, because aim stability and recoil, steadiness. If y'all don't got that, because I think you unlock this with the EBR, uh, you can go ammo reserve, no problem. If not, I would just say, instead of ammo reserve, go for this until you get the Bruin TC or TS comb. And then after that, this fucking UI is stupid, cuz. After that, you go with the Bruin HCR-56 stock, Recoil control, of course, per usual. Here's the tunes for this. I don't know if I showed y'all the tunes for this, but there y'all go. And yeah, that's it. That's that. That's the STB 556. Five, Fucking laser beam. I hope y'all like it. I'm going to test it against the M4. But uh, yeah, let me just go back to the gun range real quick to show y'all. Aim and stability is very freaking crucial, bro. Y'all don't understand. Like, look at this. It's literally barely moving, cuz. It's moving. Barely. Like, you could put it on somebody's head and confidently stay within the range of his head, bro. Like, look at this. Like, look at this. This target is all the way down there, right? My aimer, my crosshair is, is, is able to stay on the dude. It's staying on the freaking dude, bruh. So when you randomly shooting and your character, because look, normally the idle sway, if y'all don't know what it is, it's usually the person like, <sighs> breathing and moving. Of course, I'm over-exaggerating. He don't breathe like that. But he it's usually moving like this, like somewhere like this. It's kind of bad in this game. The idle sway is kind of bad in this game. If y'all don't realize it, take one of y'all guns that have nothing on it and just aim it down sight. 
The idle sway is going to be kind of ridiculous. So think about that when you're running and you're shooting somebody, the gun is still doing that idle sway. So if you find a situation where you're aiming at a person, but your bullets is missing, it's probably because of that, uh, that uh, idle sway. So aim stability is a fucking must. Like, look at that. Look how this gun is a fucking beam. But I'm going to leave y'all on my aim. I can't even stay on target. Look, me doing like this. I got to get my, my, my aim in. Locking on target skills better, but y'all leave me alone. Don't don't talk shit. Y'all probably better at locking on to targets than I am, but I don't care. This gun is a fucking beast, cuz. Anyway, if y'all like this STB and y'all want to see me do other guns, let me know in the comments. Subscribe to my channel if y'all didn't. I'm about to start making more Call of Duty content for Modern Warfare 2. Um, yeah. If y'all like it, like this video. Let me know in the comments what guns y'all want to see next. And until then, peace out, baby!